Hello and welcome to another episode of my let's play of Cardpocalypse Out of Time Gauntlet Mode. Last week, once again, we didn't succeed, but we had some fun runs. I did a lot of runs with the Sinisters, then I think a Meowtant run with Poofend, and then one or two talk runs. The last one was relatively successful, we made it to the final enemy, but yeah, we couldn't beat them, so... That was a bit disappointing, but whatever. We unlocked more stuff and um, it's time to go on another run. Um, to be more specific, we unlocked the Defender deck for the Woofians and since we didn't do a Woofian run last time, I think it's time to check that out. Um, the question is which... Woofian, do we play? <sighs> they are all kind of strong. This one definitely works well with defenders, so maybe we should just pick the regular old Mega Scrapper. Um, but let's check again. I feel like Queasy is, in most regards, better than the Scrapper. I mean, if I have loads of minions out and they're all Defender minions, then the Scrapper might have a slight advantage. But also the transformability and... Uh, yeah, just permanently boosting stuff, also their attack. Yeah, I think I'll go with Queasy again. I mean, as long as we are in a pandemic, I guess Queasy is very fitting. <laughs> so let's pick the guard dogs. I didn't even check what's in there now, but uh, it should be better than before and it should have defender minions and defender minions are nice. So let's check out what this deck has in store for us and hope that we can do better than last time. Um, a spiked collar is not exactly what I would have expected in this deck, but whatever. Let's go with the Astromod and yeah, we don't want you to go, or do we? I mean, I guess it makes sense to take out those lethal minions as soon as possible. So whatever, spawn them. Yeah, <laughs> good stuff. Um, so yeah, let's take out the semi-cat first and then see if the Miasma takes out my Astromod or if they sacrifice a Sinister. I'll play the Spiked Collar. And they do sacrifice the stronger Sinister for some weird reason. The AI makes uh, weird decisions sometimes, but... Uh, they have an unfair advantage in other regards, so I guess it all works out. In, uh, in recent times it mostly works out for them, so yeah. I guess I'll play the cat cubed because, well, whatever they do, one of their minions will die and I guess that's to my advantage here. Or, well, not whatever they do if they just don't attack, but they do. Okay, um, hmm. <sighs> I could prepare the pokey for... for next turn, but then my bonus will probably just be defeated by the Mega Miasma, but whatever, I don't really want to have my Pokey being taken out in, uh, instantly by the Spotted Ferret. Okay, Spotted Ferret taken out by the Boneless, that works for me. Okay, there's my lovely little Woofian. Okay. That is nice. Um, hmm... Yeah, well, let's just play the pokey. It'll be strong. 
Oh yeah, <laughs> it'll be even stronger. Uh, all right, I guess I'll just boost the wolf here to deal some damage right now. Now they can't even attack with their champion. All right, this is over. Nice, nice. I like this deck so far. Um. Okay, another smolder and another hot dog. Gloodle and Docko. Docko might be useful. Hmm, Pincher. Pincher could be super nice against lethal minions. This might be really nice to keep our minions alive and well, the Gloodle could get really strong. But I feel like the pincher gives me more versatility and we can get the gluttony. I'm not gonna um, not gonna not take that. <laughs> okay, they start. <laughs> Sorry, it's rather late here. Still pretty busy with um, um, what's it called? Exam preparations and all that. <laughs> okay, hmm, that might be a problem. Hmm. Pincher, on the other hand, might be helpful. Yeah, whatever, let's start by playing the boneless. Um, I wonder if I can reduce the toothless attack below zero. I'm not quite sure if it works that way. Uh, problem is my smolder could get taken out by the toothless instantly if I play it and the toothless becomes lethal. That would not be nice. It wouldn't even kill the toothless, so that's pretty horrible. I guess I can also play the astromat and the smolder. Eh, let's risk it. If I fail now, I can rest. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that's not I. Still not I. Oh. Okay, at least the toothless is dead, <laughs> but still, uh, definitely not ideal. Oh well. Could be worse, I guess, and doesn't seem like we'll lose now. Still looks alright. I guess I'll play another pincher. Ooh, that's not nice. Yeah, but also not horrible. I don't have super strong minions out right now. Super inverters. Okay. I guess. Good. Oh, <laughs> didn't realize that they would go mega from this. What did that do? Oh, all minions minus one attack. That's nice, actually. I can work with this. 
Uh, but now the Glower will get stronger and stronger, which is not ideal, but I guess we'll make it work. Now we'll get Mega 2. Or not, um, but we can. Bit too late though, since the bonus is already a problem. Eh, well, whatever. Let's get another defender out. Hmm. Take out the boneless. Eh, why not? Hmm. Could attack. Yeah, let's go mega. Speed things up a little bit. Oh, interesting. I'm out of cards too, but this is over now, I think. Yeah, it is. All right. Swamp Hound, Mutation Based, Snappy Mutation Based, Defender and Minion, Strong Minion Boost basically, but only, oh not, not really, a boost based on Strong Minions, yeah not a fan of the Power Paw. Popcorn and Atomidoc, also Mutation Based. Huh. I guess the Swamp Hound could be really useful if I can make it work. Definitely need more mutations for it, but maybe we can achieve that. So who do we want to ambush? Um, Pokey or Skinless Cat, I guess. Uh, well, let's go with the Pokey. I guess we want to keep the Defender Minion's health high. And Morph. <laughs> yeah, put Morph on the Smolder, basically defeating itself. Um, yeah, I don't think so. But yeah, Morph on this one might work, I guess. Okay, it's Bloop. Let's see how this goes. We will get a new mutation. The wormhole. So that's something. Um, mm -hmm. I guess this works. Already utilizing the swamp hound. I like it. Pincher can wait until next turn. Okay, I guess we make the Woofian stronger and just take out the tiny head rat. Yeah, seems reasonable enough. Yeah, maybe it would have been smarter to do that on the Invertus and let the Venomous kill itself then next turn. Or no, 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 kill the Venomous now and then let that enemy minion, uh, the Tiny Head Red, kill itself on the Invertus next turn. That was what I was actually gonna do, or thought about a bit too late, but yeah, this works too, I guess. So, yeah, let's just take the, let's not take the Venomous out, <laughs> but let's deal some more damage to it so that it can take itself out next turn. Maybe, yes, because of AI. <laughs> the bloop would have been strong enough to do it on its own, but that's okay. Um, 
I guess we can boost the Swamp Hound a bit more to keep it alive. Uh, yeah. I guess we can just play the Pokey. Take out the semi cat. What do you do when you go mega? Um, okay, well, I guess we can deal with that. Mega. They can take out my pokey, but that's not a huge problem. Wormhound stays alive. Can't really play anything. That's okay. Okay, we can't really make sure that the Swarmhound stays alive. Uh, but if the bloop attacks them, it'll hurt them more than me, I think. Yeah, pretty much. Alright. Good match. <laughs> so, more mutations, power cells. Oh yeah, that boost the attack of boosts the attack of one of my minions in the best case scenario. Bits of blitzer. Yeah, I guess the power cells are kinda cool and I wanted more mutations, so that works. Next battle, let's go with the sidekick. Seems good. Hmm. Get the morphing snappy. Okay. Works for me. Um, I mean, it's not really ideal. <laughs> I guess I would like to take out that Terrapin and that Constrictor, but uh, I can do neither, I think. Sad. Well, well, well. Could put out a lot of defenders. Maybe that'll help. I mean, keeping my Snappy alive seems reasonable. Constrictor will get stronger, sadly. Uh, but, oh well, we'll see. Let's get this one down to three attack and one HP next turn. I guess maybe that makes sense. Maybe, not really. I don't know. Guess we'll take out the constrictor now. So that's good. Um, how do we do it though? Guess we could just attack the constrictor with our champion, take out the inverters with the pokey. Guess that seems reasonable. Don't want to let my minions die if I can prevent it. And, well, tiny head rat. Sure, why not? Hmm. Do we want to attack with the snappy? Eh, why not? Oh, because of that. Kind of, uh, well, didn't really forget, but didn't even notice to begin with but hey sure it'll work out there's some cat snoring going on in the room I hope that's not too distracting um, if it is I'm sorry but I can't really do much about it so um, let's have the pokey take out the constrictor now I think or could have the tiny head rat do it and use the pokey to attack the barbs 
Mm. Well, I guess that makes sense. New attack. Um. to go mega right now could play the cat cubed or wait for this pincher to be ready next turn yeah i guess this is all right oh well, no they are mega but at least they couldn't attack right away that's something um Cells might be useful. Uh, yeah, I guess let's play with the power cells. Could just attack like this or use the pincher to weaken the sinister first. I guess we just take it out. Use the pincher if we really need it, like in a pinch. Haha. <laughs> My jokes are amazing as always. Um, yeah. I uh, guess we can play the cat cubed now. Okay, and we're ready to end this. Uh, Nice, nice. Huh, two docos. That's interesting. Um, Humongo pop. Uh, now I think two docos seems reasonable. And more morphing. Um, don't really want the inverters to morph. Also, Swamp Pound. I guess I want the Swamp Pound to have more health than attack, usually. So I guess the Cat Cubed will morph now. <laughs> eh, maybe it'll make a difference at some point. I mean, if it loses health, it can still morph. Um, okay, more attack for someone. Yeah, why not? Let's have the pincher have more attack. Okay, Fluffles, yes, that was its name. Okay, uh, can't really activate the steel skin just yet, which is a bit sad. What are your abilities? First minion to attack gains stun until the end of the turn. <laughs> okay, and boosting stun minions later on. Also providing stun. Yeah, might be rough, but let's see. Um, I guess I'll just uh, go with this. Ooh, that's mean. Ooh, that's super mean. Guess no healing for me. Well, have some cards. Okay. Hmm. Not sure if I want to play anything right now. Ah, I guess it makes sense to play the boneless, so they have to decide if they want to take out the tiny head rat or the boneless. If they don't have something else 
on their hand that helps them take out both of them. Doesn't look like it so far. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we could activate the Swamp Hound thing, but only, well, it still would take us two turns until then. I uh, guess we don't have to play the Steel Skin just yet. Let's see what happens next turn. We'll see what happens when the cool cat attacks, if it defeats my tiny head rat or not. But, uh, yeah. At least I could deal some damage to the fluffles. Yeah, of course. Targeting side. Was to be expected. Could have been worse, though. Um, okay. I guess we could just wait another turn, not do anything right now. I'm afraid they might steal our minions too though, so maybe let's play the Swamp Hound. Yeah, that was kind of the right choice I guess. They will use it to attack my champion, but I guess that's okay. We'll survive at least and then next turn we can play the Pokey and the um, Steel Skin and activate the Swamp Hound's ability. I hope they don't activate the Swamp Hound's ability first, but we'll see. Yeah, good, here we go. So, I um, guess we can even activate two mutations. Yeah, yeah, that should work. Nah, uh, okay. Hope they don't deploy a defender minion. And we do this and this. Now the Swamp Hound takes out the Scratchers and there's another minion for us. Nice. All right, I think we got this. Yeah, looks like indeed we got this. Yeah, should uh, should be sufficient damage. Alrighty, another victory in the back. Cool. Looking good so far, but that doesn't mean too much, sadly, um, because things can turn around quickly. Okay, what do we have here? Power paw, spiked collar. Eh, spiked collar I like, power paw not so much. Blitzer Blitzer. Um, well, power cells are cool. The Blitzer Blitzer can be super strong um, if you have a mutation. But even if you don't, it's not the worst thing. Six foot four five five. It's definitely not great, but. I guess we can work with that. Yeah, let's go with this. Okay, next battle only. Uh, I guess this doesn't make a huge difference, so let's just get 10 more health and hope that that maybe saves us in the worst case scenario. Or plus one attack, that might be super helpful actually to take out minions and all that. So yeah, let's do that. Especially against Pipsqueaks. Okay, got too many mutations on my hand. And that is not nice, but we also got the Pincher. That should be helpful. Okay. <laughs> Bit overkill, but whatever you feel like. Um. Yeah, 
I guess this makes sense. Hopefully, I mean, I suppose that not both of them will survive, and if they're smart, they are gonna take out the Doco, but eh, we'll see how it goes. Oh, Valor is gonna get strong this turn. Seems like they are going okay, maybe, <laughs> maybe not. Yeah, the AI is really weird sometimes. Okay, um, sure, let's boost the pincher. Could deploy another doco. That should be helpful, right? Yeah, I think so. Whoops. Yeah, first gotta take out the fatted ferret. Then destroy the newly spawned fatted ferret with my queasy, I think. And the pincher can take care of the fungus. I could also play the power cells and boost the pincher some more. I might also save that for later though. Yeah. Okay, one doco down. Alright, um, I guess it makes sense to have two, three attack minions in this situation. I want to boost the doco though to keep that one around as long as possible. What happens then? Uh, okay. Hmm. Guess I don't really want that to happen right now. here. Um, guess we could boost it. Okay. Yeah, let's have the pincher take out the fungus. and cat cubed take this pip squeak out and I guess I play the wormhole to get a new minion next turn could also play the smolder might be a good time for it doco attack yeah sure doco attack Thanks. <laughs> All right, guess we got this. Nice, nice. So, another Bitsa Blitza and a Hexadog. Hexadog is a nice late game minion. 
and as I said before, the bits of Litsa can be quite strong too. And this is no fun at all, I think. So let's just go with this. Seems balanced and two strong rare cards. So yeah, let's take them. Ambush. Um, hmm. Do we want Ambush on the Doko? to deal some damage without hurting itself or on the Swamp Hound to deal some damage without hurting itself. I don't know. Eh. Or on the Bits of Blitzer to deal some damage to the champion without hurting itself. <laughs> oh, I guess Ambush makes sense on everything. Let's put it on the Bits of Blitzer. Swarm. Hmm. I guess that makes sense on the smolder. More health. Uh, once again, Dock or Swamp Pound. I guess let's put it on the Swamp Pound. Okay, seven. Cypher. This is always an interesting battle. And Cypher starts. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, well, I can take out one of them already, so that's good. And... Uh, that Harbinger is a bit annoying. Uh, well, the Toothless as well don't want them to draw cards, so... Hmm. But that Toothless can easily take out minions of mine. And if I play the Pincher, the Harbinger and the Champion can still take out the Pincher. Uh, not ideal, but I guess I'll do it. Having a 3-4 minion would help in this situation. Would have liked to save that uh, mutation plus trigger for later with the Swamp Hound, but maybe this makes sense. Let's do it. I think I'm not going to play anything else, just in case they might have that um, uh, mutation that spawns uh, two lethal charge minions when they have less minions than I do. Okay, so they don't draw anything. That's helpful. Um, guess let's boost the Astromat. Keep it alive a bit longer. I mean, yeah, I guess now I'm gonna take out the minions and if they have that mutation they will spawn those lethal minions, but better now than uh, before. So, yeah, here we go. Taco? Sure, why not? Let's see how this goes. Yeah, there they are. Ooh. Well, that doesn't have too much. Oh, it's only one. Well, that's cool. Okay. Oh damn, that's not good. Well, my doco is still around, which is nice, but there's also a Sinister around capable of taking out my doco, which is not nice. Let's just make sure that we can take out that Sinister next turn. Uh, I guess I'll attack just in case. Okay. Hmm. So they don't kill my Doko. I can work with that. Okay.
Spiked collar and snappy seems nice. I'm just gonna try to slowly take out that Puthon. <laughs> eh, okay, I guess that's not an option. Oh, well, maybe I'll still take that Puthon out slowly and... Or quickly, kind of depends. Oh yeah, quickly works too. I can just weaken the Puthon and then take out the Lickety with my champion. That's kind of cool. Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> Not enough food! Oh well then, I guess the snappy is gone. Sad, but uh, we all have to make sacrifices. <laughs> nah, not gonna attack this time. Cool, second doco. That works for me. Um could also play the smolder. Yeah, I guess that's cool right now. Thanks. Very helpful indeed. Uh, uh -huh. I guess it makes sense against a deck with lethal minions to have more than one strong minion, so I guess that's what I'm going for here. Can't play anything, so let's just do an all-out attack. Smolder is not hurt anymore. Okay. Yeah, Smolder might die. Oh wait, we can now play the Pincher. Smolder might not die. That's okay. Still gonna take this out. That's mean. like to have enough food for the Bitsa Blitzer next turn, so maybe I'll not play something right now. I guess so. Mm, tech with the Doko or... Yeah, I guess let's do it. Hmm. Oh, it's not a huge problem. Hmm... Okay, well, I guess if I play the Pokey, I won't go Mega for a while, so maybe the Bitsa Blitzer can wait. And I can protect my Doko and all that. So yeah, let's do that. Oh, yeah, and they go Mega now. Mm -hmm. Wait, okay, boost someone. I guess we could boost the Pokey. Um... Okay, so that's why you're strong right now. Um, well. Okay, good enough for me for now. Okay, seems like we got this. Not quite yet, but almost. Um, yeah. Let's just, uh, I don't know, boost the Doko and use the Pincher and the Queasy to take out the Toothless then. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. Um, yeah, so we have not won yet, but next turn. We should win. Cool, cool, cool. All right. 
Yay! Another victory. I'm getting a bit tired, but I'll try to keep my focus. But I guess I'm not gonna do another run after this. The Gizmo. Whenever this minion is damaged and survives, deploy a 3-3 minion. That sounds kinda cool. Especially with healing, also the Pincher is still a nice thing. Popcorn, Bitsa Blitza could get a third one. <laughs> Um, Doko is still cool too, mm, but yeah, I guess the combination is the best here. I like the Pincher, I like the Gizmo. Let's do it. And next battle boost, champion plus one attack again. Yeah, let's do it. Round eight, three more. I would really love to have a win again. Let's see. Okay, got the Hexadark a bit early. Well... Hmm. Well, the Smolder should be nice right now. I think I'll only play the Smolder, so I don't cause any lethal minions to spawn or anything. Yeah, well, there is a lethal minion, but I can work with that. I have a pincher for situations like this one. I have two pinchers for situations like this one. <laughs> bye bye, Puthon. And let's weaken that fell shell. Yeah, I think this is enough. Once again, I don't want the lethal minions to spawn right now if they have mutations like that around. Okay, that was one of those mutations and another one. Okay. <laughs> Works for me again. So I don't have to be afraid of lethal minions. Looking good so far. Uh, I don't really need to boost the Smolder to defeat the Constrictor, but it would be nice to have a bit more health on the Smolder. Yeah, let's do it. So, do we play something? I guess we could play the Boneless to take out whatever they play. Would really like to get a dock hole sometime soon. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, well, as long as we don't get a dock hole, let's just boost our smolder to keep it alive. skinless cat or just wait or play the cat cubed and still be able to play all of these minions next turn yeah I guess that's reasonable yeah I'll stick with my strategy That might actually be helpful. Let's pop. Give my smolder alive even longer. Uh, this would get them down to 16. Maybe. Maybe let's get them down some more. Then swap everything. Mega. Yeah, I think we got this. Oh, we even got a doco. That's cool. <laughs> Thought it would survive, but yeah, they have more attack now because they are mega, but it doesn't really make a huge difference, I think. Yeah, looks like we got this. Nice, nice. Right, quick one. Two more. Let's see. Fell shell and stable mutation. Eh, 
ginormous. Two less food for each enemy faced on mutation. Enemy mutations cost two more. Interesting. Cataclysm, four attack, plus four attack for each face down mutation I control and blood frenzy to boost my champion's attack. Uh, this is a tough one, not a huge fan of any of these to be honest. I mean the Cataclysm can be strong but it's super expensive and I mean you need at least two mutations for it to be worth it. Not sure how often I can make that happen. Fell shell is kind of cool, drawing a random mutation. A stable mutation, I don't know, can of course be useful, can also be completely pointless, kinda. But I don't know, I guess the ginormous also only works well when the enemy has, well, it's already pretty good when they have one mutation, I guess, to have a 5-6 minion with that extra ability. So I suppose you could make it work, but still 8 food, or well maybe 6 when I actually want to play it, that's rough. I guess I'm gonna go with these, they are at least not gonna hurt me. Um, Mutatorama, the ball or shuffling. I think... It worked quite well knowing which cards I have on my hand and keeping them for later. Um, so yeah, I think I'm just gonna go with the Mutatorama and hope that it works for me. We'll see. Maybe it'll bite me in the back. Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> Okay. What's the seismic storm? Reveal a face to mutation. Okay. Yeah, I guess if that triggers now, it could be worse. Uh why not? Let's weaken a splitter and steal the pincher if you want to. Yeah, you do. Seismic stomp! <laughs> hmm, cool. I got ambush. <laughs> Spite spores. No, oh, maybe they'll attack with my pincher. <laughs> that would be pretty cool. Um. Hmm, could still play the pokey. Uh, but then they'll just destroy my pincher with it. Maybe I'll not play anything right now. Which one do I attack? Uh, I guess the one that can hurt my minions first. Uh, I could still... Now the lethal minion could also just destroy my pincher, so I guess I'm good. Yes, thanks. <laughs> Boost it. Boost it even more. I love it. Boost my pincher. I'll get that one back. Okay, I don't like this. Shouldn't get more attack than you already have. That's rough. Oh well. We'll make it work, I'm sure. Um, okay, untouchable. Hmm. Sadly, I can't do that right now, but maybe next turn. Um, shell will just die. I guess I can play the doco. Yeah, that should work. Yeah, let's take out minions that could attack us. Okay. 
Okay, how do we do this now? Yeah, let's boost the doco. And okay, first we gotta take out the splitter. Oh yeah, and then we can yeah, that will boost the pincher, that will be nice. Okay, cool. Yay. <laughs> Super strong pincher. Here we go. Um I could play something like the fell shell. What's the essence cannon? Um Yeah, I guess let me take that. I can't do that right now, but that's okay. I can still deal some damage to their champion. Could play the wormhole, but I can also do that later. There's not really a huge chance of me going mega right now. Yeah, okay. Seems like they're gonna steal my next minion. <laughs> <sighs> it's just too many mutations here. Doko or Pincher. Guess let's go with the Doko. Just to be safe. Okay, <laughs> so much for being safe. Oh, crap, that was not nice at all. I'm so afraid of them stealing a minion of me now. Yeah, oh, damn. Could play the doco, but it would probably just kill itself. Whatever. Yeah, here we go. I uh, guess I'll take out my own boneless. <laughs> hope that the doco only attacks my queasy. I would really like to heal my pincher a bit. Ah, oh, come on. Okay. That's rough. Uh, well. How do we do this? Could play the pokey. I mean, they're not gonna steal it right now, so that's good. And it would take care of the slick. And I can keep my pincher um, at least a bit longer, which is nice. Yeah, just hope that they can't defeat the pokey and attack with the Silic on my champion again. That would be horrible. Hmm. I'm gonna save up for the Bitsa Blitza. Okay, Slick is gone, that's good. All right. Pincher still alive. Guess I will be mega next turn, so maybe it's time to play the wormhole. And or the spiked collar, but I'd also really like to have enough for the Bitsa Blitza next turn because it will get boosted by the spite spores. So that will be quite useful. So which one do I take? I guess the stable mutation keeps me kind of safe right now, so let's go with that. I mean, 
would be nice to trigger my mega mutation thingies, but yeah. What happens when you go mega? Ooh, okay, I guess I don't want to have two minions by then. Uh, interesting, 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 and also quite annoying. Well, let's see. That wasn't too helpful, but I mean, at least we can take it out now. Nice, nice. And Mega, so maybe we can even win now. Seems like it. Um, whatever. Oh damn, no, we can't win. Stupid me. Should have boosted the pincher, it would have survived. Yeah, well, whatever. Um... Uh, whatever I play now, <laughs> they will get a copy of it, I guess. Uh, so that's rough. Damn, how can I do this without killing myself? Oh, crap. <laughs> mistakes were made. I don't like losing by making mistakes. Ah, oh, crap. <sighs> Guess the Pizza Blitzer is out of the question because, yeah, well, they will get a copy of it with Hasty. Hmm. I would need a charge minion, ideally, but I don't have one. Ah, so stupid, why did I forget that? Damn. Hmm. Eh, well, I guess I'll just play... Not the Bitsa Blitza, but, uh, well, yeah, the Spiked Collar to boost my attack next turn. And the Hexadog, hoping that they don't have anything else to deal damage to me, because, well, the Hexadog will have six. Sphinxter, four, anti catter one, so that's 11 in total. What's the other ability of the anti catter Yeah, okay, well, that would be a problem, but they... Well, yeah, they could trigger this. That would be horrible. Let's see. Let's hope. I don't know. Eh, eh. Damn. Why am I so stupid sometimes? Yeah, well, there goes my hexadog. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Seems like I win, actually. Hmm. Oh, okay, because the Mega Sphinxter doesn't have Ambush anymore. Okay, well... Works for me, I got lucky. Okay, no more stupid mistakes now. Uh, keep your focus. <laughs> uh... Okay, what do we have here? Another Hexadog. Didn't really do anything for us this time, because, well, they copied our minions. That's not gonna happen all the time. Popcorn, yeah, not sure. Brutish Bulldog can be quite useful, I guess. Humongo Pop and Zapper. I mean, the Zapper is quite cool. The Humongo Pop, I don't know. I guess in most cases it should be helpful. Well, also makes all my minions attackable. Also the ones I don't want to be on the front line. So I guess it's good at good and bad at the same time. The Brutish Bulldog is like 
really good at the start, but then gets really weak really quick. So I'm not sure. Eh, whatever. Let's take the Brutish Bulldogs, I think. I mean, if we get the Doko out with them, that could be quite cool. Boost someone's attack. Um, well, hmm. Uh, I guess I'll make this Pokey a bit stronger. More attack on someone else. Guess I'll make this Pincher a bit stronger too. Morph on uh, Skinless Cat, maybe. I like my defenders to have more health than attack, so that's fine. Yeah, so Skinless Cat, I guess. All right, and somehow, despite my <laughs> horrible mistake there, we made it to round 10. Okay, here we go. Please let me win. I need a win. Last time at, at least we made it to Anguish. Okay, and we start with two Brutish Bulldogs. That's actually quite cool, despite the fact that we could trigger the Mitosis. Oh, well. I guess we start with two Brutish Bulldogs then, and hope that the Mitosis even isn't too horrible for us. Two Brutish Bulldogs seems like a good start to me. Also, we got the power cells that we might be able to trigger. Should I attack? Shouldn't I attack? Uh, I guess I should not. Because if I do, then I can still attack with my two brutish bulldogs, but it will make Wolfgang go mega. Okay. Uh, now it will anyway. Mm. Okay. I can't attack Wolfgang. Two hot dogs. Um, I can boost someone, though. Um, I can also <laughs> double power cell or let's keep it balanced. Let's make this 7-7 seven, seven again. Let's attack this one. Boost my brutish bulldog. Oh crap, that doesn't even work. Okay, so at least good that I didn't play my additional power cells, because that wouldn't have helped at all. Nah, can't do that, and they can probably, so that's not great. But hey, we'll see how it goes. At least I didn't make a mistake by playing these power cells, so I'm okay for now. Hmm. Yeah, whatever, I'm gonna attack the assassin. They're probably gonna attack the brutish bulldog with it anyway, so it doesn't make a difference. Oh, crap. <laughs> it does make a difference. Ah, so much for no more stupid mistakes. Well, here we are. Stupid, stupid mistakes were made again. Um, hmm. Okay, once again. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> Ah, once again, I don't have, um, uh, what was I going to say before my voice? Oh, I don't have a five cost minion or more to play for the spite source, sadly. Uh, I don't know who to boost. of your turn. Hmm. I would hope that they make mistakes um, when that happens. So maybe they play minions first and then attack and then it doesn't help them any uh, anymore. So I guess I'll hope for that. I'll also play the Fell Shell. Okay. Hmm. Don't have any Defender minion on my hand right now, but we'll see how it works out. I guess I'll just leave it at this for now. And they go mega and can play whatever they want. Okay, damn. Okay, no 
okay, okay. Sure, sure. <laughs> yeah, not ideal, but eh, we'll see. Stupid fly. <sighs> um, not really sure who to boost. I mean, if I boost this one, at least we can take out the brutish bulldog. we can whatever this is rough <laughs> um, Problem. I don't know, I really don't know. <laughs> uh, this is so rough. This Wolfgang ability really really mean with those uh, high cost minions that they had on their hand uh, why can't the AI make stupid mistakes when it's needed oh well let's see how it goes okay Chikara's dead that's good Okay, I don't know, maybe we still have a chance here. Guess we'll see. Could play the power cells. Also could play the swamp hound and... Yeah, I guess we could do that. Why not? Okay, let's see what happens now. I could still weaken the Brutish Bulldog. I'm not sure how helpful that actually would be, but whatever, let's do it. Or that happens. <laughs> Why? Well, I'm not even Mega yet. <laughs> what do you know? Uh, okay. Just attack this one. Boost it again. Oh, seriously? Where did that Wolfian come from? I don't understand anything anymore. This is mean. Oh, probably. No, I really don't know where it came from. I don't understand. <sighs> Thank you. 
Oh, they have the Swamp Hound too. That's where it came from. I guess they revealed... Yeah, the mutation. Yeah, okay, makes sense. Okay, okay. Uh, well, crap. I'm dead. Almost. Uh, oh no, I am. With the iguana bug changing. Yeah, okay. Crap. Mega. Wait. Couldn't they have attacked me again? With the Swamp Hound, the Woofian, and the Wolfgang itself. And with that, like, defeat me. Okay. Don't do it then. Torture me some more. <laughs> Whatever. I um, guess we gotta take out that Puthon. Um, well, as soon as my Queasy attacks, I can boost another minion, so that's kind of cool. Wish I could play the Steel Skin and the Wormhole, but that does not work. So I guess I'll just play the Wormhole to protect myself here. Um, I guess I have to use the Queasy to attack just for that 2 2 boost for one of my minions, which probably is going to be the Swamp Hound to take out the Puthon then. Uh, don't like this at all. dead so <laughs> pretty sure I will be dead soon enough but uh, whatever uh, sucks that I can't use my queasy's ability basically because attacking is Hurting myself far too much. I guess I played the steel skin and the inverters. Because I'm scared. Yeah. I don't know. And I could boost the inverters even more if I attack with my Queasy. Maybe that's actually useful. I mean, it's the only thing keeping me alive right now. I think. <sighs> Whatever, let's take it out. right now but next turn I could play the smolder that would be quite awesome um, <laughs> could go down to 1 HP and boost my inverters some more yeah whatever no risk no fun that was my final attack I guess if I don't get something to give me ambush again 
We'll see. Okay, that's rough. That doesn't help you at all. Sadly, it doesn't help me either. Hmm. Uh, it would have been so nice to, well, the smolder wouldn't have gotten boosted attack either, so I guess <laughs> that would not have been nice. Um, okay, well, whatever. Let's play the smolder here. Um, to have some more protection out. And let's just deal five damage to this one. Huh, to get its attack a bit lower. Uh, could still attack. But could also just wait and hope that they attack the smolder instead of the inverters. Yeah, let's see. Thanks. Okay, I guess I should wait for the doco to be ready. You can take this one out. Seems reasonable enough. Okay, and then we get the doco and can heal our minions. That could actually help us out a lot. Okay, let's see where this goes. That's something we have to take out. That's not good. <sighs> That's gonna be a problem. <laughs> I'm dead. Stupid mutations. I could do something, but I really can't. <sighs> this is so annoying. Wait, I mean, I guess I could. Could just destroy my Doko and the Smolder, but yeah, then now still they will get the. I think I ruined it by playing the Skinless Cat right now, actually. I'm stupid. Because I could have made it even, or well, like in a way that the Smolder still can block the damage. That's not possible anymore now. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, well, take your victory. Uh, of course you also gain ambush. Oh, I gain ambush. Cool, that's actually pretty useful. Wish I had gotten that sooner. And I'm dead. Uh, so annoying. There are too many mistakes there at the end don't like this. Okay, what did I unlock? Let's see. Pouncers, deck upgraded, nice. Uh, minus two food as battle reward, that should be quite helpful. 
All right, it's something. Uh, I'm sorry for making these stupid mistakes. That's really not how I want these episodes to end. I mean, if I fail because it's just too hard and unfair, that's okay. But to feel like I failed by making stupid decisions and stupid mistakes, that's a bit annoying. I mean, I guess it's just human to not have uh, everything, um, like your focus on everything, especially if you're kind of tired, like I am right now. But that's my fault. I shouldn't maybe record when I'm super tired. Eh, whatever. It is what it is. It was a fun run nonetheless. We made it quite far. Um, I think this is a deck, like a champion deck combination that could work. Maybe I'll try it again next week uh, when I'm more uh, well rested and more focused. Maybe I can do it then. Would be awesome. Um, definitely learned new things here. So uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please uh, consider subscribing to my channel, hitting that thumbs up button and maybe also writing a comment down below. I'd really appreciate that. Um, since I'm interested in your thoughts uh, and also in how annoyed you are by my stupid mistakes and all that stuff. So yeah. In any case, uh, this is it for today. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you again next time. Until then, take care. Bye.